My name is Ethan Bash, and I am a medical oncologist, and I specialize in the treatment of prostate cancer. At UNC, I serve as physician-in-chief of the Cancer Hospital and as chief of our division of oncology. I chose to go into oncology because I find it to be an incredibly rewarding place to work with patients and families. It's a very difficult time for many people when they are facing a cancer diagnosis or a cancer journey, and to be able to help people, to communicate with them, to provide the information they need about what treatments suit them, to help them in shared decisions is very gratifying to me. I've also been involved in cancer research throughout my entire career, and I was attracted to oncology because of the tremendous opportunities we have with research to improve the lives and the experiences of our patients and to make our outcomes better. As a physician working with patients, especially when they first come into the practice, uh, I suppose there are a few characteristics of how uh, I deliver care and interact. The first is that I'm very evidence-driven, so um, I do like to discuss the most cutting-edge treatments and science. We are a large research institution and we're involved in, uh, in much of the ongoing central research um, in cancer, and in my particular case in prostate cancer. And so discussing the options plays a prominent role in what we talk about. I'd say that stylistically, uh, I am very focused on, on quality of life. And I will frequently discuss with patients the trade-offs that are involved related to quality of life. We may have a treatment that has some effectiveness, but it also has side effects. And we need to really think about what those side effects are and how they're going to impact the way a person lives their life. During treatment, I frequently want to know how people are doing, how they're feeling, how they're functioning. Can they do their, their daily activities? Are they able to do the things that they want to do? Is our treatment impairing how people want to live their lives? From my perspective as a cancer doctor and a cancer researcher, I, I appreciate how difficult it is to face a cancer diagnosis. And of course, like many people, I've had my own family members or good friends who have faced a cancer diagnosis. And one of the most gratifying parts of my own career is that I can be a part of helping people when they face this diagnosis, when there are so many unknowns or uncertain outcomes, to be able to understand as much as possible for a patient what the options are, what they may be facing in the future, uh, and for me to be able to support people through that is very meaningful.